All right, so we got that. Uh, interesting. Uh, we could possibly... Yeah, let's go for the next one then. Well, let me see if, like, maybe I plus placed a book here or something. Oh. Worth a try. So let's pick up the grenade launcher, then we're gonna pick up the ink ribbon once again. There we go. The old man is holding a candle in his hand. The light will guide you to a greater truth. Like, the reason I looked at this thing is because, um, it looks awfully familiar with this. So what I'm thinking is, possibly, really hope that, uh, my lighter, I mean, there's a reason why we have a lighter, right? Manages to do something, and it does. All right, sweet. And the door unlocks. Awesome, sweet, sweet, sweet. We could have, you know, probably done this a long time ago. Honestly, I... I just noticed it right now. <laughs> I just noticed the painting. I just... Get the fuck out of me, man. Holy shit, that scared the fuck out of me. Alright, so we got more ammunition for the, uh... Or, or grenades for the grenade launcher, so that's good. Uh, I think there's nothing in here, though. Oh, wait. Hold up. Hold up. Okay. Uh, what is this? The filling cabinet is... The filing cabinet is in a state of total disarray. But there doesn't seem to be anything of interest, though. Ooh, shit. All right, so you're going to be able to push it. The reason I came over here is because I thought we were going to be able to, like, go behind this thing because this, this thing seemed out of place. Wait, maybe I'm supposed to push it from the front to the back? I don't think so. All right, cool, cool, cool. So I think that's another book. All right. I'm gonna push it all the way just in case. This is some accidental greatness. I literally walked into that room with that poor. Oh, the book of good. Oh, would you look at that? I can't carry it. Hold up. Uh. 
I'm dropping the knife. Fuck that. I haven't used the knife at all. I don't even know if like I could damage zombies with it. I maybe you could. Maybe it's different for this game. But in Resident Evil 5, you weren't able to like damage the zombies at all. So uh, you know, I'm gonna keep it. I'm gonna keep the knife. I'm gonna leave the gas tank here. Uh, yeah, you weren't able to kill zombies with the knife in Resident Evil 5. So that's why I haven't tried it here. But that might not be the case. Who knows? I thought I was going to be able to read it or something. I guess not. All right. So, uh. I'm surprised it didn't, uh, yeah, I'm surprised it didn't allow us to read it. Hold up, maybe it's in the files? Nope. You see, now I'm actually way more curious that these books will fit in with the uh, with the uh, uh, black statue and white statue, since you know they follow the scheme of black and white, good versus evil. So maybe by placing the books on the on the um, on the balance scale, that's gonna like maybe trigger something. That's my uh, theory at the moment. Yeah, like I was mentioning, like I went through that room where like that uh, portrait with the candle man was uh, was at like a thousand times at this point, and I never realized it until like I walked in that time. I looked at the portrait, and then I looked at the door. And then I saw the candle, I was like, oh man, it's that. So that's why I went towards it. Uh, okay, where's Rebecca? Oh, she's behind the door. Okay. Oh, we're able to move them now? I was really hoping that that would work by placing the two books there. Because that won't be the case.
Yeah, I'm uh, low key mad confused right now. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. I'm mad confused right now. Because unless I like sk skip the 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 contents of the book when I picked it up, but I doubt it. I don't think nothing happened. I think I just picked it up. Uh, because unlike unlike uh, this one, with this one it gave us like a little thing, uh, like a little passage and stuff like that. But with this one it didn't. So, I mean, I know you gotta do something with these two to activate something, uh, but I'm still not too sure what though. Like, I mean, I tried everything with the uh, with the statue over here, and that still didn't work. Uh, I really couldn't find anything on the files. I was trying to like read them like carefully for like a clue or something, but that doesn't seem to be the case. Like unless I go behind this or it seems unusually heavy for the book of its thickness. That's that's the thing. Like I feel like that has to be like a clue. So like I don't know. It's not, uh, yeah, and it's not even giving us like an option to like pick, not pick it up, but to like open it or something. <laughs> Just when I said that, it literally appeared. <laughs> All right, open the book. I mean, I get. Oh, it's the uh, it's the angel wings then. Yeah. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Yeah, it's the angel wings uh for the uh for the statue. Wait, white stone shaped like a pair of wings. Wait, so does, does that mean, hold on, let me actually check this out first. Uh, what the fuck did I do? You gotta like aim at it? Okay, so you gotta aim at the pages, then press X. Alright, so that's that's the crazy thing, that with this game, I, I sometimes like overlook things that you, you really can't overlook, you know? Uh, you gotta think outside the box with these games, I'm not gonna lie, like you really gotta like look into it we got the black wing I think with that it's gonna like balance it out hold up I'm, I gotta try this like the fact that I was like really confused for a good second not knowing how to figure it out and it was basically you know I, I had it all along like on me so that's crazy that actually happened to me multiple times in the train I didn't know how to open like doors before like, uh, you basically just had to, like, activate or use the button, the use button, basically. Um, this. You don't need this item right now. I guess not. Oh, uh, shit. Oh, I see. Okay, so I might have to combine them. Okay. Uh, yeah, I might have to combine them on the on the inventory. So I'm gonna drop my uh, ammo. I'm gonna drop my ammo. I'm gonna pick up the black angel first and see enough if, if I could uh, combine them that way. Let me take this one first. Okay, there we go. Nice, 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 nice. Uh, so we got that. You know, for the longest time, like in the past streams, what I would think was like, I probably had the wrong angel or the wrong statue um, to balance out the black statue. I didn't think you were supposed to like build them. So that's interesting. All right, so now we got both. Might as well just use this one now. Oh yeah, that makes a lot of difference. I just hope they don't make us like look for the heads now. I knew there was something with the freaking portrait. 
it's like it was so ominous every time you like walked by it it was just like the camera would just like point straight at it so i didn't mean to do that i knew there was something there like i was about to what i was about to do if i hadn't actually figured out you know what to do right now i was thinking of like freaking uh trying trying to explode the uh the portrait up with the um with the grenade launcher because i was thinking i was like for a good second i was like i don't think they're just giving us a bunch of like grenade launcher ammo or for nothing like it has to like we, we have to destroy something i feel like i'd be like overlooking things that's that's the thing about me i'm gonna go in alone just in case i, I still don't feel I have no idea what the fuck that is. Holy shit, dude. Oh, we're poised. Oh, wow. Okay, so. Okay, yeah. Now that's gonna come in handy now. Alright. I just hope that when I come back down here, it's not going to, uh... It's not going to, like, come back to life and shit. Because <laughs> I think I noticed that about this game, that uh, if you don't, like, completely finish off an enemy before you leave the room, the next time you come back, it's going to be full health. And I can't pick it up. There we go. So, so unless you take on like too much poison it will reduce your health but if it like hits you once you're gonna be poisoned uh but once you like heal yourself i think uh, you're gonna go back to like the base uh health you were in before you got poisoned if that makes any sense oh yeah we're, we're, we're definitely gonna be facing off against spiders now all right, that's gonna be interesting. <gasps> oh, no way, bro. Oh my god, thank god, hold up. Oh, and there's more freaking ink ribbons. Sweet. Hold up. Let me actually just pick these up. First things first, there we go. Dude, this is amazing. Holy shit, dude. I'm gonna leave the poison thing there, the poison herb, just uh, just in case we ever need to come back down here. Um, it's gonna be like easy access. The reason I can pick up the document. There we go. All right, so that's the list for uh, basically everyone they experimented on. I feel like that's going to become a reference to like later games. Maybe like the ones that survived and ended up being mutated are going to be like bosses or the main enemy for that certain game. So I'm going to I'm going to see if I can remember those names if we ever encounter them again. Oh man. So it seems like they were feeding something in here. 
And okay, so I, I think it's gonna be the next boss then. Yeah, cause uh, I mean they had a lot of weights holding it down. But then again, it must must have been the. Uh, I have a feeling like it's gonna be the leech uh, leader that escaped through the vent because I mean it's a small vent. But I mean he was strong, so uh, I think it's the leech leader. So I'm gonna go heal um, Rebecca. I'm gonna go heal her right now, and uh, we're gonna come back down here, and uh, yeah, we're gonna save. And uh, I think we're gonna end it there. Maybe. Jesus. Oh, wait, where's, where's Billy at? Oh, okay, there we go. This way. Okay. You know what? I should probably pick that up and just exchange something with uh, Rebecca. So I don't have to, like all that hassle of dropping things so uh there we go i'm gonna leave a stash of ink ribbons right here I don't think we need to take six. I don't think that's gonna be uh there's gonna be a point for that. I'm just uh leave this behind. I kinda wanna take the grenade launcher just in case. Just in case uh, just to be safe. I'm gonna do that. Just to be safe, you know, just in case we like encounter like any more ammo for the grenade launcher, we don't need to like return all the way back here. Like, the crazy thing is that for such a long time, <clears throat> pardon me, Rebecca and uh, Billy both were, like, at such a critical state, like, uh, in their health, that now it feels weird having both of them, like, you know, with good health and, uh, decent, uh, ammo. So I'm gonna let Rebecca take that. There we go. Wait, who has the uh Oh I do, okay then.
you know, I was gonna stop it there, but you know what? Might as well. Like, just keep going on or further. Just a little bit further. If we die, we could always respawn here. And uh, if we do die moving forward, I'll just end the stream there. And uh, yeah. Because uh, I have a feeling we might be like encountering like another boss, but you know, who knows? could be of service. Time to go inside. Someone is very freaky in there. That's an electric chair. Yeah, my, uh, <laughs> I'm pretty sure I saw I saw that in, like in a medieval dungeon or something. Uh, flip the switch down. Um, let's see. Not sure if I did something there. About the power regulator. I see okay so um okay so by the chain do they mean yeah i think that's gonna be the case okay so it seems like it's locked so i think i'm gonna be leaving the uh, stream right here um yeah i think i'm gonna leave it here and uh what i'm gonna do because i think what they mean is that we gotta go back to where the uh big insects were at the uh the the area where we fought the centipede and i think those are the chains they're talking about that we gotta like uh put on or make sure that they're like connected that could be the case i could be mistaken once again but i think that's gonna be the case but I'm gonna end the video, not the video here. I keep, I'm like in YouTube mode right now. Uh, I'm gonna end the stream here. Uh, I'm gonna stream Wednesday, even though I said I wasn't gonna stream. I'm gonna stream Wednesday morning. Uh, basically, my uh, uh, whatever I had to do that day, I managed to, you know, get rid of it. Um, you know, uh, I, that space opened up, so you know it's gonna be right on schedule. Um, then again, I'm gonna be streaming maybe on Thursday. And if not, I'm going to be streaming till Saturday. So, uh, yeah. So, it's going to be Wednesday, Saturday, and then, uh, yeah. But I won't be able to stream Friday. So, uh, yeah. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed the stream. Uh, check out the uh, the videos, uh, the shortened videos of the stream on YouTube. I'm going to be posting them there. A bit more edited so that you guys don't have to see all the, like, me wandering around. But, uh, yeah. Thanks for watching once again. And I guess I'll see you guys next time. Peace.